Hi, I'm Steve Walsh, military reporter with WHRO News. The House and Senate are expected to clash over the final defense budget after the Senate passed its version of the bill, leaving several projects for Hampton Roads hanging in the balance. The Democratic-controlled Senate passed its version of the annual defense bill late last week. The Republican-controlled House bill includes several hot-button social issues, including ending the Pentagon's Office of Diversity, Equity, and Inclusion. It would also end a policy that pays for women service members to travel to other states where abortion is legal. Senator Tim Kaine says those elements are likely to be removed from the final compromise. American service members are in places where they can't make their own decision about lawfully terminating a pregnancy. We would allow them to travel. We do it for Peace Corps volunteers. We do it for federal prisoners. Why would we tell a service woman that she has less rights than others? The Senate version of the bill includes more than $500 million for projects in Hampton Roads, including expanding childcare at Little Creek Fort Story and improvements to the public shipyard at Norfolk, which has experienced delays. Lawmakers are still hammering out the details of a pact with Australia, which includes building more Virginia-class submarines in the area.